Hello and welcome to the Motorcycle Report. My name is Ryan, and if you're like me, you want to know all there is to know about the past, present, and future of the motorcycle world. Today we're going to talk about the all three, past, present, and future. And that's all going to be wrapped up in a company called Janus Motorcycles. I'd like to read to you their philosophy from written from their home page on their website, janusmotorcycles.com. You know, the thing about Janus is you, you look at them and you go, oh, that's one of the cutest things I've ever seen. They're, they're right next to Whizzer as far as the cuteness factor goes. Uh, you know, there's cuteness factor and everything, even motorcycles. So uh, they have a bit more power than uh, Whizzer has. Yeah, but there's kind of a step up in in uh, many many ways and they're a true on motorcycle they don't have uh, pedals like a wizard might have or a moped might have they have a 250 cc engine which is you know just fine for one person and and it'll get you where you want to go it's not going to get you there uh, super fast but it's going to get you there just fine speed limit and then some and what a great bike, uh, you know, handmade parts, uh, parts made by, let me say that again, parts made by hand, okay? And that's cool. Made to order bikes, so if you order a bike from a motorcycle from Janus, then uh, you're, you're getting it made as you order it. It's not already produced and you just buy it like a cookie cutter type of a deal. They make it by, you know, a lot of it by hand. So, you know, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into uh, the philosophy they have written on their website. And we'll start now. It says on the JanusMotorcycles.com website, our philosophy, motorcycles are like architecture. They must be beautiful, functional, and made to last. Form and function are inextricably paired in a way we seldom see anywhere else. What is it about motorcycles that's so captivating, that makes the experience of riding so wonderfully invigorating? We are convinced that motorcycles, in order to provide the perfect ride, must not only be functional, but also beautiful and well-made, perfectly fitted to their purpose. Motorcycles are not primarily about efficiency, but about an experience. Many manufacturers during the golden age of motoring took advantage of their small scale and flexibility to develop sophisticated balanced machines and, at the same time, were able to acquire their powertrains and transmissions from specialty manufacturers known for their quality and reliability. Like them, we find a great deal of satisfaction by bringing in proven specialty components and concentrating our attention on providing a superior chassis, a balanced riding position, and the highest level of finish and quality. Apart from a few cast aluminum and electronic components, everything on the bike is manufactured within about 20 miles of our shop, allowing us to focus on the handling and high level of quality that are the hallmark of a Janus motorcycle. The past has a lot more to tell us than the future simply because it's already happened. Our architectural interests have led us to look for inspiration in the traditions of classical design. We approach our work as a special challenge. To achieve the clarity of form fostered by the best of small-scale manufacturing and to recapture the drama powered by movement through the American landscape. We are interested in the great machines made by our predecessors as models of concise beauty and terse simplicity. The bikes made in our small American factory aren't replicas, they are contemporary, practical machines that celebrate the art of motorcycle design over the last century. The traditional and labor-intensive process of hand production permits Janus to create the endlessly rewarding connections between motorcycle form and rider experience. The design and manufacturing process developed by Janus in northern Indiana involves small production runs focusing on the highest level of quality and performance. This approach mandates a motorcycle different from any other made today. 
The process involved in the mass manufacture of most motorcycles dictate most aspects of their design. As a result, the industry is subservient to the lowest common denominator in marketing and cost. We aim, in contrast, to achieve the closest fit possible between the reality of manufacturing and the ideal of design. Our manufacturing process also guarantees a fundamental simplicity of operation and maintenance, making possible a closer relationship between rider and machine. A motorcycle that is perfectly thrilling to ride. The spirit of motorcycling is best understood on a small, lightweight machine, like the majority of bikes produced over the course of the last century. The rider observes a more powerful sensation of speed and feels a more direct connection with both the road and the passing landscape than the occupants of automobiles or many of the heavier and higher powered motorcycles common today. The experience of the road, acceleration, and terrain cannot be more directly experienced in any other way. We are building machines for men and women who love the freedom, joy, and mobility that a motorcycle allows, especially if they can work on them themselves. Janice would like to encourage a younger, broader generation of American riders and to achieve this by producing beautiful and practical small displacement motorcycles. And then they go on with pictures of their key staff on the page. And forgive me if I pronounce names wrong. They have co-founder Devin Beck, co-founder Richard Worsham, and production specialist Ryan Roberts. Oh, Ryan. Okay, well, at least you've got a good name there. Uh, then below they have more names. Cameron Gruntman is production and testing. Kelly Borden is paint and assembly. Chase Borden is assembly. And Jacqueline Sonner is customer care. And then they have Jordan Schwarzenruber and Grant Longenbach for media and marketing. So we're looking at very few people here who are putting these bikes together. I, th I don't know if this is a complete list, but it's probably pretty darn close. Uh, you know, and then they have local shops that they work with extensively to uh, to do more things to the to their motorcycles but uh, it's really the majority of it's in-house and uh, quality testing sounds very uh, rigorous and everything that sends good signals to someone who's looking for an authentic handmade piece of equipment to experience the United States open road on or I'm sure they ship overseas to Europe and other countries and that would be just as much fun to ride there so Anyway, I like these guys. If you hadn't, couldn't tell that by now, that <laughs> you're not listening very closely. But uh, these these guys are great. You know, they they all are, have their hearts set on what they're doing, and I think that's what really counts. All right. Well, that ends this report. If you like this video and you'd like to hear more, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Thank you, and I'll talk to you soon.